Hello my dear friends, my name is Parth and I welcome you to our channel Must Watch Tips. Today I am going to show how to make this SWOT analysis PowerPoint presentation. If I click on next, it will show me strengths. Then if I click on next again, it will show me weaknesses and so on. And this consists of only one slide. So you need to make only one slide and this animation will work throughout. So watch the video till the end and see how I made this. So first of all, let us take a blank presentation and I'll delete this predefined text boxes and I'll go to insert and I will insert a rectangle. So vertically, it will fit this whole slide area and let us select no outline. Now I will duplicate this rectangle by pressing Ctrl D or Command D and I'll place it over here like this. Again, I will press Ctrl D twice. So I replicated the rectangle four times. Now I will select all of this and group them in one. So I'll press Ctrl G after selecting all. So now it is grouped and I will stretch this four images like this. So now we have distributed four rectangles equally among the slide area. And I will ungroup this now. So you can see that there are four different rectangles I have created. Now for the color selection, you can go to internet and search for the color palettes you want. But let me show you one of my favorite website. So I'll go to the website called colors.co and there I'll go to explore. So now let us say I am in the search of red color palette. So I'll search red over here and press enter. So it will give me the color palettes related to red shades. So I'll take a snip of this. Let us say I want to have color from this palette. So I'll uh, take a snip of this like this by pressing window S, window shift S and I will paste that over here. Let me paste some more color palettes over here. Here you go. Now we want to take color palettes from this. So I'll pick color from this one. So I'll select first the rectangle in which I need to fill the color from this one, uh, the snip. Then I'll go to shape format and in the shape fill, I will select eyedropper tool and let me choose this color. So I'll select on this and it will automatically take the color wherever I will click. And in the similar way, I will select the second rectangle, go to shape format and in the shape fill, I will select eyedropper tool and I will select the second color. Like this, I will select for all. So now we have completed adding colors to these rectangles. Now let us insert a text box. So I'll select a text box and write S was strength. Let me make it bigger and let us choose the font style to be Arial Black and I'll place this over here. Now as I have created S, I will duplicate this and place it over here and I will write W O and T. Now I will select all of this and I will select, I will go to arrange, align and let us say distribute horizontally. So it will distribute equally. Now let us again align this all in one line. So I will go to arrange, go to align and select align in the middle. So now they all are aligned in the middle. Now let us change the font color of this. So I'll select all of this and let us select this color. Now let's add animation to this text boxes. So I'll select all of this, go to animation and I will apply wipe animation and let us select from left side and let us start on click. Now the next step is to add other text boxes which will appear after the S gets swiped out. But before this, let us insert some logos. So we'll go to insert icons and 
you can select anyone from this so let us say you want to select for strength you you want to select this icon and few icons you can select from here let us say this one this one and maybe this one and let us say insert i'll arrange those icons like this for strength let us say i am taking this icon and let us say uh, the color of this is light gray now let me quickly add text boxes so i'll just paste it from my clipboard so if we go to selection pane we can see that there are certain amount of objects which we have added now let us add animation to the remaining ones the remaining objects this one the title and the subtitle i will select all of this go to animation and let us apply wipe animation from left side now if we go to animation pane we can see that there are multiple uh, animation applied over here so first we want to wipe out the s okay my dear friends we need to make one correction instead of this wipe in animation we need to select wipe out animation and same for this three text boxes let us select wipe out animation like this now for this uh, strength symbol the text the title and the subtitle we need to have it right after the s get wiped out so we have arranged it in such a way that after s gets wiped out the symbol the title and the subtitle will appear and in the similar way this three things will appear after the w gets wiped out the next three will appear after the o gets wiped out and same goes with t now let us change one thing that for these three animation let us select after previous and for the second one let us select with previous so the icon and the title will appear at the same time and after that the subtitle will appear let us apply the same over here let us select all of these three select after previous and for this one let us say with previous so the pattern goes like this so let me summarize it for you first the s text box will wiped out and then the graphic and the uh, title will appear and after that the subtitle will appear and same goes with w o n t so this is how the animation pane will look like and now we have completed this slide so if i click on slide show it will look like this so first only s w o n t are visible now if i click on next s will wiped out and the other text boxes will appear along with the logo if i click on next again the w will wiped out and the text box will appear same goes with o and t so this is how you can create animated swot analysis powerpoint just using one slide i hope you like this video and please consider subscribing to our channel and share it with your friends hoping to see you in the next video till then goodbye